area up and down California. It's called the Palms to Pines All-Female Air Race, and it started in 1969. And aviatrixes have been gathering to take part ever since. And a team based in Lincoln just won the race on their first try. This morning, Gary's on the go at the Lincoln Airport, introducing us to the prop tarts flying their, uh, their team there. Gary, they, they ready for takeoff? Oh, looks good, looks good. I'm checking out the plane. I gotta make sure everything's good. Make sure, even though the race is over, they could be doing another one. Uh, the Piper Super Cruiser is good to go. Yeah, that wing looks good. Oh, I like how the paint is nice over here. And uh, tire pressure looks good. All right, good. There you go. Uh, Christine, did I do good, Christina? You did do, did I did great, good. yep. Michaela, did I do okay? You did great. Do you guys feel safe now that I oh, gave it yeah, a Oh yeah, definitely. You checked all the important things. <laughs> no, no, they know exactly what they're doing. All right, uh, maybe Christine, you could tell us real quickly, you guys just won a race, all female race, your first tryout. That was pretty cool. Tell us what that was. Yep, so this was the Palms to Pine. It's a historical all women's air race uh, starting in Santa Monica, goes over Red Bluff and ends in Madras, Oregon, which is just north of Bend. So it's about 750 miles flown over two days. Congrats. That's so awesome. I love that. All right, Michaela, you're inside. You're mic'd up. You, you could tell us what's going on because you kind of had like a, uh, you got to get a little, a hand, not, I don't want to say a handicap. Someone kind of told you how to really do this race, and that kind of helped you guys, huh? Yeah, we're lucky enough that I'm a member of the 99s with Julie Clark, who's a world-famous racer. She took me out to lunch. She gave me all the secrets on how to win the race. She's actually won it herself. She's an incredible um, aviator, just a real legend. And then Andy Bibber of Adventure Flight took me up and showed me how to do everything that Julie Clark told me how to do. So we had we had a little bit of a, an edge. You had a little bit of an edge, a little bit of an advantage, which is great. All right, cool. And then, how does the Pop-Tart handle? Pretty good? Handle goods up, up there in the sky? Oh, yeah, she's a dream. She's a dream. How long have you been flying? Uh, well, a while now, long time. I mean, I've been in, in co-pilot since I was 16, so. Okay. There you go. All right, and you, how long have you been flying? Uh, it's been about four years and 2,000 hours of wow. my time. <laughs> that, that is just so cool. All right, we can go on and on and on, but I know you guys want to see this thing start up and, and uh, move a little bit. Can we do that? Maybe you'll take off later? Yeah. But can you do that for us? Yeah, let's do All it. All right, go, go and close the door. We'll get out of the way. All right, here we go. Clear prop. All right, she's clearing the prop. We are out of the way. And there you go. Holy cow. And uh, Christina, when you guys are actually in the race, how fast are you really flying the plane about miles per um, hour? I mean, miles per hour would probably be about 110, 120 miles per hour. So pretty slow. It took us about close to eight hours of race time to get all the way through the race. And it was a couple of, uh, you know, a couple days too, right? Correct. So the first day was about five hours of flight time. And the second day was about three hours, which was a nice little treat That's to awesome. have a, sec a little break. <laughs> we saw inside there, it's kind of close quarters, you know. So she's just, obviously, she's going to go over there and make a little turn. I wish we had a little bit more time. We could take off on that thing. But it seems like it was a lot of fun. Again, congratulations. And uh, you guys are still friends after that long, long trip, right? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> uh, There's a few moments that definitely tested the friendship, but um, with snacks and breaks, I think anything was possible. So <laughs> That's all you need. Take a little break snack. All right, she's there. I'm going to wave her in, and uh, I'm going to send it back to you. I don't know what I'm doing. I think I'm going to go like this, right? I'm going to go like this. Here we go. We Gary, go. all right, there you go. There you go, got it. Gary's got right, it. I mean, he's, pra you. he's practically a pilot, Gary himself. Very cool. Congratulations to the Prop Tarts for that amazing victory and cool little plane right there. All right. Now